What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the latest episode of Pokemon Omega Ruby Wonderlock. Last episode, you guys, we beat Steven and basically won the game. But, um, ordinarily, that would be the end of it. But, I decided I wanted to do the Delta episode, the uh, post game thing. Normally, I don't care for post game stuff in Pokemon. But I've never done the Delta episode before, and I figured, why not, right? Oh, hey, Dad's actually home for once. Okay. Well, if it isn't Jason, you sound like you were surprised. It's been some time since I last saw you, but you look stronger, somehow. Or the impression I get. Huh. But your old man hasn't given up yet. On what? Before I forget, I was thinking I'm giving these to you. Alright, the tickets, because you got work and you can't take mom. Tickets to a star show that's being held at the Moss Deep Space Center. I thought I'm going with your mom, but it looks like I got washed back to Jim and Pebblebug. Wow. Okay, you know, it's a pair of tickets. Oh, thanks, Dad. I can see that. Why don't you invite that cutie May next door to come along? Dad, Dad, you're barely around as is. Stay out of my love life. Better be heading back to the gym. Bye. I'm still looking after the house while I'm away, dear. Have a seat. Okay. Oh, that daddy yours. He comes home for the first time in ages, and he always talks about his Pokemon. I can't hear, but let it go and relax. Um. Uh, I, I guess being a gym is a big responsibility. I'm going to the star show, latest news and updates. Okay. Just like that, look at this, Jason. Yeah, it's a TV. The Lit Leonid... Lit Leonid Media Shower will turn to illuminate Hoenn's next sky. Star show held at Mossy Space Center will provide the best view of the Shooting stars from the center's lofty viewing deck. Sounds lovely. They let Leo nids, huh? I remember going to see him with your dad 11 years ago when he when they last passed by. Ah, uh, that where I was conceived. Much over there, invite that never go your friends with. Can't let it go to waste. Okay, I mean you, you raised an excellent point. Oh, it's this person. Whoa, are we in sync or what? You know, I was just thinking about you. Really? This way to meet you. It is our first real meeting, right? Yeah, that's right. Of course it is. Okay. It might be because I watched the um show Lucifer on Netflix, but this is giving me really season six vibes. My name's Zania. You... I know all about you. You're Jason, of course. You're the new Pokemon League champion. And you're one of those special few who use Mega Evolutions to get closer to the Pokemon, now aren't you? I mean, I was until my Pokemon who could Mega Evolve died. Oh, I know, I know. I'll leave it alone. Look, I'm stopping. But sure is a nice place, isn't it? Little Root Town? Everyone living here is just so nice, too. Okay, you kind of creeping me out. Like that neighbor of yours. What'd you do to me? Oops, sorry. Didn't mean to go on like that. Should I keep our first meeting short and sweet, don't you think? Till then, bye bye. I, I don't know who this person is, but they are starting to creep me out. May, you okay? Ow. What should I do? What should I do? Oh, Wibble. Oh, Wibble? Not that big a deal, Ma. She just knocked me down a bit. Many years ago, okay? Also, she hit me. Ouch, that stinks. Well, get an ice pack or something, May. Come on. Oh, Jason. Jason, you're alright, huh? That's a relief. After so fast, I couldn't do anything. Some strange woman came in my window upstairs. Uh huh. Then she 
she took my keystone. I tried to fight her off with my team, but she was really strong. Also, I don't think you can bring your team out in the middle of your room, considering it's a pretty small space. I get stand a chance. Well, I'm sure you tried, me. I think I heard her muttering under her breath as she left, though. Something like Pepper Books next? Be careful. Okay, so we gotta chase the bitch down. I love using this Eon Flute, but I wish I didn't have to see this cutscene every time. You know, I mean, it is nice and all, but it's like, come on, just let me, you know, go. Also, like, like this cutscene is just like... My character should, should have, like, broken legs right there. Okay, wait, are my Pokemon all healed up? Yeah, they are. Okay, excellent. Also, I should probably turn off the EXP share now. Because I don't think I'll need it. I, I mean, I'm probably gonna have to fight someone. Probably that Zendaya, but... Okay. Wait... That? Is that Courtney? Alright, well, if I'm gonna be fighting Courtney... At least I think it's her, right? Yeah, she's the one who talks like that. Tedious, bothersome child. You should just be quiet. Give me a keystone. I'm telling you, I don't have it. I already know that you can use Mega Evolution. Ah, uh, are you even listening? I've been telling you. Jason! Yeah, it's her. Okay. You. <laughs> nice timing. Maybe. I'll be taking yours first. Give me the keystone. Yeah, no. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. What level is Kim going to be? Wow. Okay. I would say I'm over level, but I already knew that. Dive, dive, dive! Aha! You missed. And I didn't. Yeah. Nice. Just down. Huh. It always nothing. That's how it is. The music falls. The latest kiss on. The end of the falls now. Thanks so much, Jason. The strange woman and suddenly attacked me demanded I hand up on my keystone. Too fast, I couldn't give it to her even if I wanted to. My keystone is gone. Was it stolen? I looked in the house when I went out and it just disappeared. Ah, okay, Zuni, you probably took it. What's going on? Something like that shows up again. I got protect my mom and dad. Y you do that. You do that. Okay. The entry call, version 009. Um, hello? Hello? Is that you, Jason? Ah, oh, not tell a mocker. Oh, never mind, Steven. How you been? I imagine you must be quite shocked. Mm. Communication mode that Devin's still currently developing. Comes in Star and every program at plus. I thought I would only use it if I needed to contact you urgently. Well, it looks like that time has come. Now I asked this of you, but he can come to Devin Court. I have to talk to you about in person. Okay. Neat. So that's, that, that's what this uh, Delta episode is going to be, isn't it? It's just going to be one continuous... Okay, go here. Now go here. Okay. That's not too bad, I guess. Because this is going to be the final episode. I'm probably going to do the whole Delta episode. Hopefully it doesn't drag on too long. Huh. Definitely remember to glass up the back of the farm, because... Why not, you know? The only one on my team that's not level 60. Don't know what happened there, but okay. Jason, I'm talking about something new, so suddenly... 
It's well known how often my intuition turns out to be right. Never imagined we'd be meeting again this soon. I'm sorry to say it's not happy news. Sigh. This isn't something we should discuss in public. Let's go inside. After you. Okay. Kinda of miss a little bit. Thanks. Here. Welcome, welcome. It's been quite a little while. So I understand all. Recently, I seem to forget details just as soon as I learn them. Ah, he laughed. Uh, Dad? <clears throat> I know. I know what you want to say. What a hasty, impatient one you are. What are we to do with such an impatient one for our Pokemon League champion? Oh, well, that's a uh, other new champion, Jason. I guess we we'll never break you out of the impatience after all, Steven. Wow! I'm dead. Dead! I know, I know. Can't you take a joke? Now, then, Jason. Plan on, plan on starting out on a lot of longer and quite heavy topic. I guess so. 3,000 years ago to when the story began. Alright. I was kind of hoping they would skip to the end. The Great War at the time, and we can fall from here. Carlos? The war finally brought an end by a weapon created by one man. And what energy source could power into a full weapon? Do you know? We might not like energy of Pokemon. Energy could be gained by the sacrifices of many. And surely many people who call it reprehensible. But my grandfather, President Devon, before me, said this. Could we use energy to improve the lives of Pokemon and people? We so developed our greatest creation here at the Devon Corporation. Infinity Energy. Oh, because that's not going to backfire. Makes sense if in the end day, Devon was able to become one of the top industries in the home. And developed into a giant you see today. Don't be surprised to learn that Devon parts you want to record for us were in fact part of a motor that would make it possible to power something using infinite energy. Not long before we began our to expand our attention for the human development. Next, we moved into exploring space. Rockets launched from massive space to so use our infinite energy. They have the truth is also what means our passion, our technology. Never really imagined it could end up as the best hope for saving the world. Saving the world. Our preamble has been quite long, but we will hype at last at the real issue. The overwhelming catastrophe which approaches us. A huge asteroid more than six miles in diameter is approaching. They have been working to get up some moss deep space in them, which was the first to recognize the danger. A devising countermeasures that would use the rockets, but in order for our plans to succeed, we need a meteorite shot. Well, that's it. I wanted to go and get that shot for you. That's my boy. I knew you'd understand. Why couldn't Steven have done it? You know, I'm just saying, why did we gotta drag me into this? It's hardly a deduction worthy of why don't you make your way to the granite cave in there, dude? You should find the meteorite short need there. Steven, head to the space center. The light cable. That's the cable warp system. I understand. The granite cave. Ah. Oh, wait. Need to warp me. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Alright. Bye bye. Okay, so he's going to Moss Deep, and I gotta go to Grand Cave. Okay. Great. Sorry if I kinda skip through that a little bit. Um, don't want the steps to run too long. Unfortunately. Okay. Go to Grand Cave. I'm just wondering when we're gonna see Zania again. Yeah. So I'm gonna pound with Pearl just in case. Um, no, because I don't want to fight it. Basically. 
I mean, we'll be able to probably run away from it, but still. in this way, right? Yep, there they are. We're gonna have to fight her at some point. Hmm, well, I think that's true. Well, it's just like a wall paint in there. This one shows primal reversion, while that one shows mega evolution. Because that proves it wasn't for all. Like way ancestors once, once lived here, too. The ancestors who passed down through me the not how to protect the world, how to avert the threat that will appear from space, as long as it was foretold from a place higher than the heavens. Um? What is Aster? Oh? Hi. You do seem to meet an alpha lot, Jason. We've met twice. Are you also interested in this old painting? Nope. Are you here for the other? One of the meteorite shards that considered the source of power for the legendary Pokemon that lived in the heavens above. Uh, no, I'm here for the. Well, yeah, the meteorite shard for the rocket, I guess. Either way, you know I adore you. Do you? That's it. I can't help it. I have to battle you. I'll play nice, slow, and ask first. You're ready to battle me, right? Yeah, let's do it. That's my boy. A good taste of having you and your Pokemon have Alpha. I feel like when people will say that's my boy to me. Oh, she looks. I tell you, I'm strong. Okay. <laughs> Can't say I was expecting that. I don't know why, I was expecting like a dog tech or something. Alright, well, let's metal claw it. Oh, so close. How much is this gonna do? It wasn't even a crit. Okay. Oh no, don't do that, don't do that. Okay. Uh, we are healing. Immediately. I'm not going to run the risk of me mashing this one again. Glad wow, that last one was a quick. Alright. Let's take it out. Yeah. Oh, unnecessary critical, but thank you. Alrighty. There we are. Oyster, come out here. Are all the new Pokemon going to be hot to win? Pretty, um... I say interesting, but we want to be something. Good job. Alright, what's this final Pokemon? Oh, her final Pokemon. Talons? Okay, yeah, dragons. Oh, good thing we have a solid ice tape, and most dragons are caught flying, so hard beat the ice. And for some reason we managed to speed it. I feel like we should have, but hey, you know what? I'll I'll accept it. I'm not gonna say no. That's just what I was looking for. Yeah, see, when she isn't like hunched over like a chimpanzee, she actually looks kind of nice. You were nice, Jason. I felt that with four points to you. That's it. Like, you get the meteor shot as a reward. Neat. Hmm? What's supposed to happen? That's the little meteor that you got there. Sure, 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 give her vibes. I'd keep a tight hold on me if I were you, along with the shot I just gave you. What do you, what, what do you mean? Just... Oh, that's why I still... Don't I still have the meteorite shard I got from... Maxi at Mount Jimmy? Hey, 
the actions you're taking now? Are they based on the ideals you're complaining to? Or are they based on truth? If they are, what's the truth they're thinking now? Okay, I, 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 I'm just calling it here. I feel like she's like from the future. That, that's, that's what I'm thinking. Alright, okay. Secure it, come back to Mosky. Okay, great. Alright, let's heal up real quick too. Just because. Okay, so she's gonna have dragon types. Okay. That's honestly not threatening at all, considering we have Cloyster. Okay. But the thing is, I don't know when we're gonna fight her again, because I can't imagine it's just gonna be once. Also, if this um, Delta episode takes too long, I may just end up splitting it into multiple parts. Maybe. I, I, I honestly don't know. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. Or I'll probably end up making it like super long. Hopefully it'll be less than an hour at life. But we'll see. Okay, so we got the Meowit Shard. Oh, Meowit Shards, I mean. We should just be able to give them to Steven and just uh, Bingo Bango and be done. All the scientists are just gone. Alright, the current plan involves using the infinite engine within a rocket, combined with the life engine of humans found in keystones, which start off by artificially replicating the massive engine that's triggered a mega evolution. We'll fire the more energy produced from our rocket into space and create a warp hole. By creating a warp hole on the top of the incoming meteorite, we hope to transport it somewhere far away from here. Okay, I hate that. It's just like, yeah, we're gonna basically transport it so it's not our problem anymore. But it's gonna be somebody else's problem. Like, wow. Is that really, like, the first solution? It seems terrible. As a matter of fact, this technology already exists and has been incorporated in some of our commonly used devices. But you know what I mean. Those panels that spin you about and out you come, walk to another spot. Where would the asteroid be warped to? Oh, we're not sure. That's even worse! W what if it cra crash lands on another civilized planet? And they get wiped out. Like, that's just terrible. It's like, well, it's not up on anymore. It's like, God. We have a device that links the warp holes. We need to get the link cable. There's no need to worry. Based on our theory, we can at least guarantee we'll be sending away from our planet. Again, that's terrible! It's like, I mean, like, yeah, it's not gonna be our problem anymore, but, like, it's gonna be someone else's problem. We realize we need more energy than anticipated. Alright, one more media shot. Oh, hey! I should get here. Nice, so this is the Hall of Famous Space Center everyone talks about. Pretty impressive, huh, Aster? Excuse me, young lady, you can't just let yourself in here. Why didn't you stop her then? Oh, what's the harm? I'll be such a stick in the mud. Right? I, I don't know what you did, but knock it off. Who are you? You're not safe here. Oh, we do seem to keep running into one another. You're busy boy, Jason. Who are you? What are you doing here? Me? I'm Zania, but your regs are old tourists. Nothing more. I don't believe that for a minute. Dreaming of taking a little trip into space. 
Oh, I see. This is what is kind of human technology in a pump of blood and sweat and tears. Well, this gets kind of long and boring, but it contains everything, huh? I know all about it. Just what kind of energy you're using to feel the logic thing. Yeah, no. Bomb the world's technology humans was thought of 3,000 years ago. It was again playing the thing that this is best for humanity. Well, that's the whole damn world. Snap my fingers and repeat the sins of your parents. And worse, if what I overheard it through, it's saying you're about to create an ever more abominable than before. Would you want to be sit here wiggling my hand or even for that meteorite to strike us? <laughs> What's up with that? You're a pretty simple guy for a former Pokemon League champion. Guess I'll hang my hopes on what our current champion has to say. Alright, Jason. You have some better idea? You bet I do. No, oh, really? That's promising. You have to tell me so we can set these guys straight. Look, I'm not here to criticize the way you guys are looking at this, even though I totally am. But I want to be sure you fought this food well and good. And you know there are necessary sacrifices, and unnecessary sacrifices. We're disappointed. This is the best you can come up with all your knowledge and technology. Instead of trying to make something out of nothing, you'd rather repeat the mistakes of the past, right up? No, you're gonna have new mistakes on top. That really takes the cake. You guys need imagination. Oops. You're all in the middle of conversation or something, right? Sorry. We we're just lost over that one. Okay, so something tells me that Shimani tried this before and that's why it's coming back to fight us. They're like, oh, we'll just send it away. Oh, we just send it into the future. Who's that woman? Where she spoke is. Woman as if she came here for some kind of confirmation. Yeah, I feel like I should know her from somewhere. She's probably your future daughter. Ah, Professor, forgive me. Maybe you're trying to tell us something before that woman interrupted us. See, now I agree with the whirlpool, we need a new meteorite shot. We need to one. So, we gotta go back to Granite Cave? No, we need to be found at Meteor Falls. Ah, we're gonna learn something there. Okay. So, this means I need to make a, another team change because we are gonna need a one that can use waterfall to get to what I would imagine. I imagine we're gonna have to go up the waterfall of Media Falls. Just my guess. Wait, why are you running? Oh wait. Now I I know I know now. Damn it. I know now. Um. <laughs> I swear, I, um, I just, I, I don't think sometimes, sometimes, um, I, I don't know, I, I just do stuff and it comes out to bite me. Okay, I think we gotta go, go to fall over, right? Before we can get the media falls. Fall, but that means we can switch out. <coughs> switch out my Pokemon. Okay, so let's see how well this is. So we're already about 30 minutes in. So hopefully we don't have to fight the Lumia again. Pokemon that I put uh, waterfall on. Now I did it for someone. Even if we do, we should be fine. You know, a fairly so we can take out whatever uh, Pokemon she has. I don't know if it's going to be the same team, probably, you know, maybe expand it a bit, who knows. But I'm confident we should be able to hold on to Even without our first 
I think this is where my fucking team from. I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. Get the use since we got married. That's impressive. Honestly. Congratulations. Married Shannon and how I am. Okay, we gotta get some. I think Mega Boss will come up with two other games. We got this. Then head that to Kawayama and Nate slash the match. Seems like this might be a probably a two part because this is taking a while to get through. Also, hyper beam, no. I mean, that's power wall. Don't like the recharge. Okay. Yeah, you guys. Are so, so sad. So sad. With passing down knowledge of mega evolutions, the great lord, lord of Kreisa, at the beginning of all. Lord. Sometimes long ago, Horn repeatedly suffered great disasters. At 
Giants and destruction took the form of huge meteorites, which fell upon our land from deep space. At other times, the power of the of our own super engine Pokemon Balls to the point of destruction. Each time, Lord Equip will create our saved from doom. The chosen Lord Keeper, standing before a stone that shone as a rainbow light, offered up a wish to a great one. Lord O'Crazen was infused, was suffused with a bright light and transformed. Because his power was more devastating before, overcoming even the super ancient Pokemon sold their primal power. Okay, so Orcrazen was able to basically battle Primal Groudon and Kyogre easily, and then like we wish he was stronger. Okay, cut stone, invocation of the Lord Keeper. And O'Crazen aren't like any single symbol, you know, metal mega version. A person, a star, Pokemon, the bonds that tie them together, transformation of Pokemon that occurs as a result of this phenomenon is called Mega Evolution. Cannon. Mechanism for Mega Evolution is discovered as a result of pushing me between humanity and Oracrisa. One last question. The Lord Keeper you spoke of. The Lord Keeper is the one who inherited the knowledge and power to summon the Lord Oracrisa when disaster impales the world. Who will keep up this current? You know, she's the one called Zania. Oh, never mind. I thought she was like from the future somehow. Has it pushed up as it has twice before, and he has been trying for some time to avert it in her own way. Do I look raised into our sphere? She joined a certain organization that sought to revive this very ancient Pokemon. Um, Team Sky? She taught them the secrets needed to bring back those threats and summon the great dragon itself. Okay! So she basically joined Magma and Aqua and she's like, oh hey, go wake up the Super Engine Pokemon. It's like, that was something a little crazy. Now she tries to land, scouting for some keystones. And then she was born and attempted to revive with the Super Engine Pokemon. So it's basically all her fault that we growled on and Kyogre will revive. You help bring the Super Engine belt? Probably not. Advancements through the sword, and so it's doomed to appear so. While people have overcome many disasters in the past, it always took great, great sacrifice. We continue with the struggle to preserve peace for as many years as we can. That's why we are protected of the sword and promise to be loved. People of one, whole nature, yes, even you. I don't know exactly what you plan to do, but do you believe you are not sacrificing anything for your protection? The near of all hope and predictions to the end. Even though the sacrifices they were born. It's a sacrificial place so over that her own heart. So she's willing to die for her conviction. I I can kinda of respect that. I understand, thank you. Big sense of apprehension. The intuition on the film true. Alright, you go back to Devon. Hopefully I can Yeah, this is gonna be way too long for me to be happy with. So, yeah. So, I'm gonna actually cut this up into like two episodes. Yeah, next episode we'll continue the uh, Delta episode and hopefully finish it. I apologize, we probably didn't get a lot done, but I don't know how big this is. DLC expansion, whatever it is, how much it's going to be. But either way, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like on this video, comment down below on I don't know what do you think of it. Which uh, Pokemon post game stuff is your favorite? Um, that sort of thing. Don't forget to go check out my other series on my channel. If you like this Wonderlock, I am also doing a Wonderlock of Ultra Sun. You guys want to go check that out. But anyway, guys, uh, don't forget to also go check out Zoom's uh, Twitch channel, link will be on screen. And if you haven't already, please join my alliance and subscribe. I could really use more minions, I mean friends, I mean... <clears throat> yeah. Anyway, so I'll see you guys on the next episode, which hopefully we'll finish up this post game. Actually, we want something else. <laughs>